Hey guys, it's the Macho Miracle here, aka Dyson, whatever you want to call me. This is kind of an update on uh, my videos for the next week or two. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be putting a video out every day uh, because today something very unfortunate happened. Uh, my grandma passed away and I. Even though I look okay, I'm not okay. Because I was very close to my grandma. Loved her a lot. Still love her. Um, she's just in a better place now. Doesn't have to be on this stupid, crazy planet anymore. Um, and getting a lot of support from my family members. Because uh, this is my grandma on my dad's side. Uh, my mom and dad are divorced, so, yeah, but it's, uh, that's whatever, that's not, that's not the point. Uh, my mom was very sorry, my mom was the one who told me, um, because she was informed of it and told me that today. Uh, so that's a way to start out my fall break. Uh, and I don't know how I'm going to be for the next few days, or weeks, or months even, I don't know. I'm going to try and get past it, but uh, I don't know. I woke up this morning. I didn't feel very good at all. I don't know. It just Today felt like an off day. It felt like a weird, just bad day. Something was wrong. And then I found out my grandma had died. And I guess that's maybe why I felt weird today. Because I don't know how I would have known, but... Um, Something was telling me that today something bad was gonna happen, or I guess that's what it was anyway, since I didn't feel good. But when I heard that, I just got even sicker. I just, I can't even right now. I just, I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know, but uh, I don't know if there's gonna be a video every day. Um, to all you who do watch my videos consistently and stuff. Thank you, and then to, to those who don't watch it very consistently, but still watch them, you know, thanks again. Uh, it means a lot to me. I want to entertain people. And then again, I might have a video out every day because it is fun to do. It relieves a lot of stress, and it might help me keep my mind off of uh, all this stuff. But uh, just forewarning, because I do, whenever I've missed video uploads before, some of you guys have DM'd me on Twitter or tweeted at me before. Um, like, hey, yo, uh, what's going on? Why no video? Those are the more consistent viewers who do that. Um, but that, this is just a forewarning that I might miss a few videos because I might not be in the mood to make or upload a video or edit and upload a video. So, just letting you guys know. Yeah. Um, I mean, I'm really wanting to cry right now. I was going to live stream tonight and everything, but I'm not in the mood for it. And I'm not in the, work. I'm not in the mood to go to work tomorrow or the rest of this weekend. I'm not in the mood to do anything. Um, I can't say it's ruined my weekend because it's not really ruined. I'm, I'm happy that she's in a better place now. Um, I'm happy and sad at the same time. I can't, yeah, I can't say that I'm completely sad, but, yeah, I'm gonna miss her a lot, so, uh, yeah, I just, just forewarning for you guys who, who watch my videos for the next week or two, I might miss a few videos, and I apologize for that, but, uh, there's gonna be a lot on my mind, so. Thanks for watching. See you guys in other videos. Uh, bye bye now. Love the faces. Today was October 22nd, 2014, which was not a very good day really for me personally because I had to say see you later to my grandma today at her funeral. Uh, uh, was something I don't want to experience ever again, but 
Uh, you know, it just, it just really sucks. Uh, but uh, all I can say is that all her family loved her. There was a lot of people there at the funeral. It was held outside. It was a really nice day. I was glad for that. And, of course, uh, I just, yeah, it, it was more of a surprise than anything, but she went out peacefully. Um, and uh, there was a dinner afterwards where the family just kind of got together and said, all right, um, we need to not be too sad because she wouldn't want us to be sad. She's in a better place now. And, we didn't say goodbye. Goodbye is what you say whenever you're never going to see anybody again. We said, see you later. Which was sad because it could be for a long time. Or it could be for a short time. But we said, see you later because we'll see her again sometime. But I'm just glad she's off this rock. She's gone off this place. It kind of sucks, really. Uh, but you know what? It's... Uh, yeah, it's a good thing that she's she's in a way better place now. Uh, and it was a very nice ceremony. I enjoyed it a lot because it wasn't, you know, it wasn't too, it wasn't focusing on the sadness that she was young. With that. And uh, I like that. It was more of, you know, the good times, which is how it should be. Uh, so, you know, I was, I was pretty happy for that. I don't want it to be anything you know, sad, because, I mean, we had plenty of time to cry ourselves out before the funeral. It was the 22nd, and she passed away on the 16th, uh, here in October. I'm actually going to upload this right after I'm done talking, but, yeah, I'm going to miss her. You know, we're, a lot of my family, we're, yeah, everybody, we're just going to, we're going to miss her a lot. She is one of 12 kids. Uh, second one to die out of all of them. Uh, she went through a lot. She had cancer, or cancer multiple times. She had a lot of lung problems. She had heart problems. She was missing an artery. For crying out loud. Uh, she, she's had all kinds of health problems and she overcame them all. And uh, whenever the doctors would give her a set time to live, she didn't just pout and give up. She's just like, okay. And carried on with her everyday life, lived it like she always did. And she survived a really long time. She just, you know, she just said, okay, whatever. Uh, because, you know, I guess doctors can be wrong. Uh, there's many times where they gave her three to six months to live. And that was seven years ago. For, like, one of the first times that I heard that. I was really sad, but, you know what, she, uh, she made it past all that. And she's with her uh, husband that died before her, my step-grandpa. Uh, he was awesome, and she's with him now. We buried both of their ashes together with their tombstone that had both their names on it. So that, that was nice. That was, that was pretty good. I uh, like that we waited to bury them both together. Um, and it was a more old-fashioned, her, her children and some of her siblings buried her with shovels and dirt under the ground like you're supposed to. So, uh, but I'm not gonna, like, I uploaded a video saying I might not upload videos for a few days, but uh, I might make more videos. Actually, I'm thinking about making more videos and putting more effort into them to kind of cheer myself up because it's fun to do. And I like entertaining people, and if I can entertain people, I can be more in a more positive and cheerful mood. So I want to do that uh, because I need to keep my mind off of it because uh, I loved her a lot. So I'm not really over it completely yet, um, but she'd want me to not be sad. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna do what I like to do, and that's play video games, hang out with friends. Just have a good time, make videos, drink Pepsi and milk, eat good food, mm. and uh, just have a try and have a good time at college. So yeah, thanks for watching this, guys. But uh, I almost forgot, as an ode to my grandma, every year on March 29th, which was her birthday, 
October 20, October 16th, sorry, and October 22nd, I'm going to be drinking a Coke, a Coca-Cola, because my grandma loved Coca-Cola, so as an ode to her, I'm going to drink her favorite drink on those days. 16th was the day she passed on, and the 22nd is whenever we buried her and put her to rest with her uh, late husband. Uh, her, uh, yeah. And the reason for this is because I'm more of a Pepsi guy. And, uh, I mean, it's not like I hate Coke or anything like that. I just really prefer Pepsi. Uh, but I did have a Coca-Cola today for the first time in a very long time. Uh, as tribute to my grandma. So, an ode to my grandma. It might sound stupid to some of you, but, uh, she'd <laughs> enjoy uh, seeing that I was having myself a Coke for her because I want to go out of my way to drink a Coke before I drink drink a Pepsi. Uh, if Coke was the only drink out of that and like fruit flavored pop or like tea uh, or coffee, okay, I'd probably go with a Coke out of those. So. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna drink a coke on those three days as a tribute to her and everything I have that she gave me and all that stuff. It's gonna go all together, and I'm gonna make sure it's in a safe spot and in good condition. So, yeah, bye guys. Thanks for watching. Love your faces.